Hello everyone, welcome to Kachima YT. Matt here with another Pokemon Go update. And today we have some very exciting news about the next event coming soon to Pokemon Go, which is the Sustainability Week 2022 event. This event is going to be really cool. We get Orangu for the first time and Shiny Cherubi, which is one of my favorite Sinnoh Pokemon. It's really cool. It's underrated because it's really cute. So I'm really excited to get that one, new Shiny. So here we go. Let's get right into the article. We have some really cool news to go over today. So the title is Sustainability Week 2022. Cherubi, Oranguru, Time to Research and More. So here's the picture that they used. It has Oranguru on there. Looks really cool. Got the Season of Alola logo. So let's get right into it here with all the info. So this event does start on Wednesday, April 20th at 10 a.m. local time, and it runs all the way until the next Monday, the 25th at 8 p.m. local time. The brand new Pokemon for Alola we get this time is Oranguru. The Sage Pokemon looks pretty sweet. I really like this one. It was a Pokemon Moon and Ultra Moon exclusive, so pretty cool. That was my first game, so pretty excited to catch this one. Brand new Shiny. Again, like every other event, we get Shiny Cherubi. For the first time in Pokemon Go, you'll be able to encounter Shiny Cherubi if you're lucky. So here's an image of Cherubi, and the Shiny is on the thumbnail. It's a bit, um, it's more pink, and the leaves are more of like a yellow yellow green instead of dark green so pretty noticeable on that one it has a really nice shiny for the cloaked form as well nice and blue instead of green so pretty excited for that one so this one is actually for during the community day which will be the next video i do i'll be covering the stuffle community day info probably that's going to drop on monday or tuesday so it says complete time to research during community day and we'll plant trees this does remind me of mr beast team trees from a couple years ago so it says Saturday, April 23rd at 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. local time. There will be timed research available and each phase will require you to walk one kilometer and doing so will earn you encounter with Cherubi. During the entire day of April 23rd, every trainer who adventures five kilometers during community day, Niantic will plant a tree up to 100,000 total. So get exploring. Pretty neat bonus and it will be helpful to the community for us to get out there and hunt, uh, hunt for some shiny stuffle. While we're doing it, we get to, you know, help save the Earth. That's pretty cool. Really respect Niantic for doing this. Pretty fun. Different from last year as well. So, let's see. We have a collection challenge again. Normal for these type of events. So, it's a nature-inspired collection challenge. So, complete it to contribute to your elite collector medal and earn a mossy lure and 15 great balls. So, nothing too crazy. There's the rewards, but another one for the medal. And since two of the Pokemon you'll need to catch, Gloom and Weeping Bell, will only appear when you use a Mossy Lure module. So you will need to use a Mossy Lure to complete this challenge. So if you don't have any Pokestops nearby, it might be a little tough for you. So you might have to travel and figure that out. They will have Mossy Lures available during the event, but we're going to get to that near the end. So Wild Encounters, these will be the boosted Pokemon. We got Oddish, Grimer, Turtwig, and its evolution Grodel. Cherubi, Trubbish, Ferroseed, and Oranguru. And all the ones with the little stars can be shiny next to them on the top right. And if you're lucky, you might encounter these ones. We have Venusaur and Phantom. Venusaur can be shiny, so that's going to be pretty interesting. Be a good chase hunt for you guys to do. Nice, rare, or shiny. Uh, let's see, we got Boosted Eggs. So 7Ks, these are only from Gifts. So you will need to add friends to get these. You will need to hatch... Obviously, here we got the rarest one. It's probably going to be Oranguru and Cherubi, but you can also hatch a Lola and Diglett and Larvitar. Kind of interesting choices there. I'm not sure why they picked those two ground types, but I like Larvitar, so that'll be pretty cool. Here's the free bundle I was talking about. So these bundles will be available throughout the event in the in-game shop, and it's an event box with a Mossy Lure module. I'm not sure if you'll be able to get one every day, or it's just one for the whole event. I'm guessing it's probably just one for the whole event, it make more sense that way. But it would be cool if they did one every day. That would be pretty interesting. And if you use that special lure, these Pokemon will appear more. Gloom, Weeping Bell, Chikorita, Grodel, Cherubi, and Seawaddle. Seawaddle, I don't know if it's for uh, you guys as well. But it's kind of rare in Michigan. I haven't really seen that many. I had to rare candy my um, Seawaddle up to leave any. It's pretty expensive and I don't even use it. So if you need candy, now's the time to get it. And if you're lucky, you might encounter the following also on those modules. Alolan Diglett, Bellossom, one of my favorite grass types, and Ninkata. 
Nikita and Alolan Diglett are the boosted ones, and they can be shiny. So pretty interesting ones there. We've got field research tasks. These are Turtwig, Cherubi, Snivy, Trubbish, Chessman, and Phantump. And again, the Turtwig, Cherubi, Snivy, and Trubbish can be shiny. So pretty interesting there. And finally, these last two bonuses here, you can get field research tasks to earn the Mega Energy for Mega Venusaur and Mega Obama Snow. And the final event bonus will be double XP from spinning a Pokestop for the first time. So if you're traveling somewhere new, now is an awesome time to set a Lucky Egg and spin those new stops. It can help you grind up to level 50 if you're aiming for that goal. I know I am. So I'll definitely be heading out and exploring to get some bonus XP. And that's all the stuff they posted at the end. It's just their you know, normal warning to watch your community. So this event looks pretty cool. I'm really excited for this one to drop on Wednesday. I'm not sure about you guys, so let me know in the comments below how excited you are for Orangru and Shiny Cherubi. I know for sure I'll be grinding to get Shiny Cherubi. That one will be awesome for my collection. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all the support recently. I've been getting a lot of nice comments and views. So thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. Make sure to stay tuned as my Stuffle video will be dropping probably on Tuesday. Going to give this one an extra day on the Monday. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure to check out my other socials in the description below. And I will see you guys again very soon this week. Take care, everyone.